These two characters, I, I told you already, I was not very excited about. I saw them, I was like, god damn it. Like, all the fucking characters they could have put in this game, all the interesting hype characters, they put the fucking maids in. Like, come on, man. But then I saw, so Furman, he put this out there. They had this picture and he linked the 4Gamer interview. As a combo, they can do things, apparently, that they can't do by themselves. So just for an example, Hisui can use her back beat and water a plant. And the plant, like, changes. So you can use, like, some of their attacks to, like, uh, to create different effects and stuff, shit like that. You thought the plant vortex was rough before? Yeah, they had some nasty, uh, plants in the old game. But this one, I like this kind of idea, you know what I mean? We're just like, uh, it's something, how do you explain this? Like, it makes sense, you know? Like, you know, you water the plant, there's a plant out there, but then it changes into something nasty. It's something, uh, it's a really cool idea, you know? It sucks, because the characters on the surface, you're like, damn, I can't get hyped to this shit. But then they they have some cool shit like this. You're like, all right, uh, I guess I'll let it fly. I have not watched this whole thing yet. But the fact that she can water the plant and it transforms greatly excites me. Let's get it. Yo, somebody linked that Boondocks tweet that uh that I had earlier. Look at the plant. Did you see the plant? <laughs> that whole trailer is just this on loop. Yeah, you know, I saw some people talking about like the teleport behind the shield. That's a that's a React feature, which I'm curious to know about because I didn't I didn't play React. Honestly, the maze looked dope. That's what I hate. I hate saying that, but like it's kind of true. It's weird because I I what's really missing from what they've been doing so far is an aggressive push towards like a casual audience so far everything they've done has almost been like hey you guy who likes fighting games and maybe even person who likes melty blood from before this is the new game we made this for you and that's not the kind of messaging you get very often nowadays you know it felt like the whole time everything they've been putting out is like just talking hey we made this fighting game for you, person who likes fighting games. And I was, I'm drawn to that, dude. I don't know how to say it. I want a beta for this game so bad. And it's not even because I want to get my hands on it. I, you can put, you can put this on record. Please make a beta. French bread, please do a beta for this game. Let people test the net code. Let people stream it. Let people talk about it. You don't even have to give me a code. I don't even want a code. I just want, I want other people. I want other people with way more, way more, uh, fucking, you know, Fucking clout, whatever you want to call it, dude. I want way bigger people than me to have access to that shit. Fuck it, let them play. I want, I, that shit, I think, I really think that did so much for Strive. I really think it did a lot. Yeah, so you see her, Kohaku assists, right? She gets on the broom and starts flying and just drops bombs and stuff below. But it's good for being able to create, like, sandwich situations like this. <laughs> he sees grabs, he grabs him in the head butts and like that? Clash, clash. What did I say last time? Every video they drop now, they gotta show some clashes off. Have you noticed that? This shit is for boomers, dude. This whole this whole fucking game is for boomers. They know we love the clash videos. They keep giving it to us. Call Kohaku to go on the other side. Kohaku, or you call Hisui and then she brings out the furniture and shit. You start beating the shit out of them on both sides. <laughs> That's godlike. I'll admit, I was not... I'm. I'm still not the biggest fan of the character, but actually watching it is pretty fucking cool. Actually. Bro, I just realized this game's coming out on Steam. Y'all gonna mod, y'all gonna mod the, the voices, right? Somebody gotta put out the day one mod. Fight back! Whenever you get sandwiched, fight back! Let him get up! Let him get up! This shit's crazy. Bro, look at the plant! Look, he got little legs! <laughs> look at him go! The plant is hype. I'm sorry, the plant is hype. Look at him bobbing and weaving too, bro. He's he just fucking scoots. So you can, I guess, use him to like advance, but then also like you can kind of hide behind him too. Look at him just walking, dude. He's coming. That shit's tight. <laughs> the fact that you can interact with it, you know what I mean? Like you water it and then it grows. That shit's cool. I like that. But anyway, that's the He's Sweet and Go Hogwarts. Right? I was not excited about these characters, but I must admit. The gameplay kind of, uh, kind of got me. I'm, um, I'm intrigued. I'll put it that way. But uh, let me know how you, you guys think they're lame. You like them? You think they're cool? Well, let me know in the comments below. I'll talk to y'all later.